Welcome back to my channel. I am Jen Jedi. For those of you who don't know, um, I make content around organization, everyday living, cooking, cleaning, all of that fun stuff. And I live with my husband, Michael. Um, but yeah, welcome back. And if you're new here, welcome. Please don't forget to like and subscribe as it really supports us in bringing you this content. Um, so obviously it is a long weekend in Australia, Victoria. We have the grand final weekend. We also have um, an extra public holiday as the Queen passed away. So um, we were extremely blessed to have that. So basically I'm gonna run you through what we did on the long weekend. We um, cleaned out the car so I'll insert that footage as well. Um, today I'm going to go do some shopping, some grocery shopping, get um, everything prepared for the week and just bring you along, along for the fun. Um, but yeah, so currently 18 weeks pregnant um, and yeah, really loving it. So it's really exciting. Can't wait to meet our little bubba. But yeah, regardless, welcome back and I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Also... We need to get Christmas planning. I, <laughs> we finally have like half our Kris Kringles, which is great. But like, yeah, we need to get Christmas planning. So I bought a couple of items from Bunnings, which I'll also insert that footage into this video. Um, but yeah, I feel like we need to sit down and do a list of what we need to do for Christmas. And then I'm going to have like a little Halloween dinner with my family for my birthday. So I think that'd be really fun invite them all over and we'll do like a party prep type of thing um like an october halloween type festive video which will be a really fun but yeah again thank you guys for watching and let's jump into today's video i just finished shopping at aldi and i'm going to show you what i got for 250 dollars um and then i'm gonna go ahead and make some lunch and then i think that we'll jump into putting everything away. So first, I just want to show you the absolute mess of a car that I am dealing with. Um, yeah, it's pretty grotty. I haven't had it clean since Christmas. So every Christmas we get the cars steam cleaned and vacuumed. And unfortunately, like this has just been left way too long. But I'm just going to start by taking out all the rubbish and putting the bits and pieces that belong in the car or in the house on the seat or on the roof so that I can put them away later. I just love having a clean car because I feel like it gives me motivation to go to work or to go out and get things done because my car is like clean and organized. Um, I'm actually sitting in it right now making this voice over so yeah like it's just so much better when your car is nice and clean and you don't have to worry about it um but yeah it was really nice to finally have this done on a beautiful sunny day um michael and i i did both of our cars and i wiped them over i didn't put the wiping over portion in this video because i just got carried away and obviously doing both cars i was quite busy but yeah um this is what I got done and then um, I'm just finding all bits of random pieces that I don't even know why they're in here so I'm just gonna go ahead and throw everything <laughs> that I do not need out as well so that I have no clutter or no random nonsense in the car but anyway I hope that you guys enjoy this video and I hope it gives you some kind of motivation to get your car nice and clean
Finally, we are onto the vacuuming, and I just want to say that I found a lot of water coming out of the vacuum when I was doing this because obviously when I had the car steam cleaned, the people didn't dry the seats properly. So there was a lot of built up water, which I think was causing like a slight smell as well. So I wasn't too impressed by that, but it's going to look so good once it's all vacuumed and I'm really looking forward to seeing it. Running through the lights of my thoughts Standing on the edge of my tongue Everything I know will be gone in a minute And that's alright Running through the lights of my thoughts Standing on the edge of my tongue Everything I know will be gone in a minute And that's alright Alright cause I'm free finally finished cleaning out the car and changing out my fragrance diffusers um i love having these in the car these are vanilla scent and i keep two um but yeah as you can see it came out relatively well it definitely needs to go and have the um major clean done at the end of the year like the steam clean that we book in because it just gets so messy and i'm sure with the baby coming it's going to get even more messy just jumping into the Bunnings haul. So we got some Christmas lights. Yay, finally. We also got some lawn seed. Um, just a, basically a whole bunch of stuff to start our lawn. And I'm going to insert the footage of Michael um, heading out there to start that. And I also got these cute little path lights for Christmas from Bunnings as well. So I'm super excited to put them out and yeah, just see how they look. But we are getting so ready for Christmas and I'm so happy about it. Um, but yeah, here's a little clip of Michael <laughs> spreading the grass seeds. Um, and yeah, hopefully it all comes up really quickly and really well because we really need to get our backyard finished so Buddy can come home. For those of you who don't know, Buddy is our dog. He is a stag hound. He is big. He is clumsy. And I'm sure he's going to own our backyard and that is fine as long as he is happy. Um, but yeah, I can't wait to have him home. Now we're just going to jump into the shopping haul. So this is basically just a quick overhaul of what I got. Um, so I got two packets of wipes, some pickles. These ones are just the sweet and sour ones and I put them with... Um, our potato salad I have two packets of these dishwashing tablets um, so we've got six to all up a glass cleaner two of these peach and hibiscus fragrance multi-purpose cleaners I've got um, some laundry liquid I've got um, toilet paper. Michael got some protein powder that cost him $50. So keep in mind that was $50. Um, we got some metal scourers, um, some Caesar salad dressing, 
pineapple chunks. Um, I got some bacon because I'm making Caesar salad for work lunches, so I'll pop that footage in as well. And then um, two roast chickens, which I'm going to cook up for tonight and then have some for lunch for work as well. I got um, this prosciutto chicken to have during the week, which seemed really nice, so I got that. Um, these meat free sausages, I love these, they're amazing. And got butter chicken for lunch, so I got that for today and this naan bread to go with it. So that's lunch for today. Michael got some Mikey beef burgers. Um, we got these because I love salt and vinegar right now. So salt and vinegar flavoured rice cakes. Um, we got heaps of frozen veggies. And then moving on to the pantry items. <laughs> um, we've got these nine grain and seeds whole grain crackers. So these are really yum with any topping that you want or like. I like them with Vegemite and butter. <laughs> and then I got um, some bread to make croutons for my salad. I also love having these for dessert. So I got some of those. Um, I had three packets of the ground rice cups, some spray oil because we were out. I got three punnets of strawberries, some puff lettuce for my piece of salad, um, fresh eggs. I got a bunch of bananas. Um, yeah, got four mangoes, some green onion, some coriander as well. I got this Thai green um, sauce to have for lunch, oh, for dinner at some point during the week. And we got some mandarins as well. So this is everything that we got. And yeah, I'm gonna make lunch and then I'll jump into putting it all away. Um, I'll get rid of the meat items first so that they don't perish, but for $250, I think we did a really good job. Also, um, you have to buy these bags from Aldi. So basically you put them in your trolley and then they just hook over like that. And they come in a pack of four and that's how they sit in the trolley. And it's just makes the shopping super simple. So highly recommend. And these are only like 15 bucks. So I just made some butter chicken for lunch and now I'm bread which is in the oven. It smells so good. But I'm really excited to eat this. was super yummy and now I'm obviously putting everything away and getting nice and organized I do need to do a pantry organization video because I literally my pantry does not look good right now 
and yeah we just really need to get it sorted so um I think I might put that in my next video um because yeah it's just looking like a nightmare but let's finish putting everything away I find it so satisfying having my kitchen organized although I would love to go through and do it all again because I feel like there's so much more that I would do now that I'm in my own place and not in a rental. We also want to get some extra cabinetry added into the kitchen because when we designed the house we didn't um, anticipate like having a family so soon here and everything like that even though the baby was planned we just didn't really anticipate like things moving as quickly as what they did for us which is fine but now we just want to get some more cabinetry added in and just focus on the um house that we're in at the moment and just enjoy every moment of it but now i'm gonna go ahead and prep lunches
So I've just finished making my croutons for the Caesar salad and I'm just going to store them in this reusable snack lock bag that I got from Kmart. I absolutely love these and they save you so much money and so much like time and they save the planet so I really enjoy these. Now I'm just going to go ahead and chop the potatoes for dinner. Although I'm not filming dinner tonight, we are having um, like a roast vegetable, roast chicken dinner. Um, I'm just going to film myself like putting it on, but I'm not going to bother filming the end result or anything like that because we are literally just going to sit down and enjoy eating our food together and not have to worry about me <laughs> um, sticking the camera in every two seconds. But I just wanted to share the prep with you that goes into making our dinner and as you can see there's a target bag on the floor we are just chaotic and unorganized but getting this video done for you guys regardless these chickens are so easy they literally already come in a foil tray you just buy them from Aldi and you pop them in the oven for the recommended amount of time per kilo which makes it super easy now I'm just going to go ahead and add in the sauce for my Caesar salad and I'm also going to add in the bacon as well. Um, so I've made five lunches for the week, which includes my Caesar salad, my strawberries, um, some mandarins, and also the honey oats for breakfast. And yeah, this is just going to put me in a good place for the week and make sure I have a nice good head start on every morning because lunch is already packed and ready to go. Let me know what kind of things you like to meal prep for your lunches. This is just so easy. Um, I usually buy the pre-made salads from Aldi, but this cost me half the price, although um, I wound up throwing one out, which is okay, but like I still felt like it was a bit of a waste. Um, so the shelf life is a lot less when you get them, when you make them yourself, but obviously I like to use all the fresh food Um and just prep it for myself but anyway i just want to thank you guys for watching and supporting us um it means so so much to us and um yeah we just hope that we can bring you so many more videos like this um don't forget to like and subscribe as it really supports our channel and really supports us in bringing you content